Good evening. This is Bombastic News. I'm Bombastic Bear. And I'm Bombastic Yeh. An attempted robbery has happened in Ipoh, Para. It was reported to be the most awkward robbery in history as the robber got away with just the straps of the victim's back. A passerby managed to record the incident down and posted it on social media. It hit 500k views in just one day. Let's take a look at the video. Now we have Bombastic Wong to tell us the details. I'm Bombastic Wong from Bombastic News. I'm here with the victim of the robbery. Anthony, can you please tell me the detail of the incident happened yesterday? Can! I tell you ah! Uh, yesterday ah, uh, I was walking home from Market Ma Ho. And then ah, uh, I feel like someone following me, you know. But I didn't care lah. Uh, I thought it was my neighbor ma, coming home, coming back from home ma. Uh. And then ah, uh, suddenly ah, uh, I feel a gas of wind ah. Uh, Vroom! I did ah. Uh, then uh, my bag dropped onto the floor already ah. Uh, say ah. Uh, and then ah, uh, I, I saw the robbery ah, uh, riding away with two straps of my bag like this. Like this all! How did the robber look like? Oh! I think he looked like a... Uh, oh! I drew a picture of him! Nah! Nah! He was wearing a black t-shirt! Then ah, uh, got one sunglasses one and then got a cat! The sunglasses is behind the cat one! Nah! This. Has this kind of cases ever happened in this neighborhood before? God, many times already, lo hey yo. But uh, luckily I lose nothing uh, this time. But uh, the robbery, hey yo. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you, Auntie Lin, for making time for this interview. Auntie Lin, please take good care of yourself. It's very dangerous. Last but not least, if anyone of you has seen this person before, please contact the number shown below. This is Bombastic Wong reporting from Ipoh Perak. Now I'll pass back to the broadcasting station. Thank you, Bombastic Wong. Those of you who are living in Ipoh Para are advised to look out for this person and take care of your belongings whenever you're going out. Next, we have... Breaking news! A typhoon just dragged San Ho in China. Here is the live feed from Bombastic Su, who is in China now. It's your turn, Bombastic Su. about the typhoon that has just happened. As you can see behind me, the typhoon typhoon is destroying the sidewalk. All the buildings are being destroyed and the roofs are being blown away by the strong wind. The government has issued an official warning to all the residents in Sanguo to stay in their basement and keep tuning on onto the TV and radio stations to keep up with the latest updates of the conditions of the typhoon. And please take care of the safety. We hope that citizens of Sangbo will be safe and sound. Moving on, we have news from AMC High School. A survey has been done by the Bombastic Broadcast Station on the popular places that students like to go in order to skip classes during school hours. Now, we'll pass to Bombastic Sin and Bombastic Rui for the details. This is Bombastic Sin reporting from AMC High School. Now I'm going to show you the places that students like to go in order to skip classes. The first place that I'm going to tell you is the lane name, the lane of knowledge. In this area, students like to come here to hide behind or under the table tennis table. This is because this place is very quiet and students seldom come here during school hours. Teachers will not even pass by this area. The second most popular place that students like to go to skip classes is of course the backstage of Datuk Chimpek Su Hall. This place is dark and deserted and it's the perfect hiding spot for students who want to skip classes.
The last place that students like to go during school hours is the toilet. It is the best place to hide away from the teachers. It is because teachers will not go and check the toilet. Although the stench is unbearable, students will do anything just to skip classes. Good morning, Mr. Good morning. What do you do to the students who skip classes? The students will be given demerits and punished during assembly in front of all the students and teachers. Oh, okay. Then how about you? How do you feel when your heart is skipping classes? Moving on to weather reports. Here are the reports from Japan, England, Chicago, and Australia. Now, we will pass to all the reporters from all over the world. This is Bombastic Hall. Now, I am in Japan. The current temperature is between 23 degrees Celsius to 25 degrees Celsius. As you can see, the sun is shining, and the sakura is in full bloom. This is a perfect timing for families and couples to have a picnic. I'm bombastic too. I'm not in England. The current temperature is between 30 to 35 degrees Celsius. It's raining heavily now, so please remember to bring along your umbrella. This is a bombastic joke. I'm now in Australia. The current temperature is between 15 to 20 degrees Celsius. It is windy right now. There is a thick layer of dried leaves under the maple trees. Besides, remember to keep your eyes open for humpback whales which migrate north from May to August. Please prepare some thick clothing as winter is coming soon. I am Bombastic Wong. I am now in Chicago, United States of America. The current temperature in Chicago is between negative 30 to negative 10 degrees Celsius. This rare phenomenon is caused by the polar vortex which is moving south from North Pole Hemisphere to the area. All citizens in this area are advised to stay indoors at all times. If possible, please avoid outdoor activities and keep warm. And that's all for the weather report. Now, we'll proceed to sports news. Bombastic Country has just organized its Bomblympics at Stadium Bomb. It is an annual event and countries from all over the world come and join the games. We'll pass to Bombastic Hall to tell you the details. Now I'm reporting live from Stadium Bomb. Let's see who's gonna be the winner of this football match of Bomblympics 2019. The ball now goes to Team 1 and it's almost reaching the goal! Oh my god, oh my god, she's gonna win! Oh, there's no fighting! Oh! Oh my god, oh my god! The girl just fell down! And this is a sportsmanship! Woo! Goal! Congratulations to Group 1! Congrats! The prize giving ceremony. Let's congratulations to Group 1. How do you feel being the winner of this 2 vs 2 football match of Bumi Big 2019? I feel very happy and proud. A big shout out to all our fans and parents who have supported us all this while and gave us strength when we are facing challenges in our career. What preparations and sacrifices have you made for this competition? Well, we have to follow our practice schedule very strictly as we need to build our stamina and football skills. We also have to follow a strict diet which is mainly made up of protein as we have to maintain our body health and strengthen our muscles. Wow, they've gone through a lot to have such magnificent results. Once again, congratulations to both of the winners. <laughs> I'm Mubastic Hall reporting from Stadium Bowl. Thank you Mubastic Hall for the latest sports update. Congratulations to the two winners who brought glory to our country. Congratulations. Now, we have come to the highlight of today's news. Korean actress Song Hye-rin just arrived in Malaysia this morning. 
She has a fan meeting that is scheduled later in the afternoon at Bongson Mall. An unfortunate incident happened as soon as the actress got off the plane. An aggressive fan tried to attack the actress who was coming out of the arrival gate. Fortunately, this unfortunate incident was prevented by her personal bodyguard. Let's watch the incident that was recorded by our reporter. Hi, I'm Mustang Joe. I'm now at the airport to witness the arrival of the current actress, Song Harry. Let's go. The reporter failed to interview the actress. Now, she is trying to interview the actress after the fan meeting. Here's what she has to say about the incident. Hi, I'm Omaste Jo. Now, I'm going to interview the current actress, Song Harry. Hi, Song Harry. Hi. Sorry to know about what happened to you this morning. Do you mind if I interview you now regarding this? So what do you think about this incident? Did you do anything that is offensive to your fans? I I I know do wrong to my fans. I this is the first time from Malaysia. Uh, I love my fans very much. Okay. So will you come to Malaysia again this time? Yes, yes. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. That's all for the interview today. Thank you. Now, I'm in the fan meet to interview one of the fans of Song Harry. How do you feel about this incident? I feel very angry for this kind of business fan. Do you know the murderer? Yes, we have some interactions last time since we have met in previous Song Harry fan meet. But don't know why she becomes so aggressive all of a sudden. Maybe Harry is in a relationship. What do you think about your idol having a boyfriend? I feel very surprised and uh, sad, but I still will support her. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you for spending your time for the interview. Hope you have a nice day. And that's all for today. Once again, I am Bombastic Bear and I'm Bombastic Ye. Thank you for watching Bombastic News and have a Bombastic Day! This is Bombastic Hall. Now, I am in Japan. As you can see <laughs> oh, Do you think about this incident? Do you do anything that's supporting to your friend? 